Hey guys, it's Cuddle of Death here, bringing you my 4,000 subscriber special thingy majiggy that you guys ask questions for. And this is also, um, I'm answering questions that came from an older video, which I didn't get to put up for my 3,000 sub special, so there are a lot of questions. But I'm not alone, I'm here with my very lovely boyfriend. If you don't like that, then that makes me sad. Don't make me sad, because I love you all. So introduce yourself, very lovely boyfriend. <laughs> Yes, I will, very lovely girlfriend. What's up, everybody? I'm Silver Slate, and I will be the one to ask these questions to Cuddle of Death. Death? I can hear just fine. I know, but I cannot pronounce the H's, and that's what. Yeah, that is problematic. So, before we start uh, answering and as asking and answering your questions, I would like to explain that I have never really played Super Mario World. And, um, this is played for your enjoyment, because you're gonna see me die a lot, so don't be like, oh my god, you suck, because I know, I suck. And, uh, we're always playing two-player, just kidding, I don't have anyone to play with right now, so I'm gonna play one. Aww. So, whenever you're ready to start the questions, I'm pro- oh, warning, 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 disclaimer. You're gonna hear the words fuck a lot, so. <laughs> okay. Because Fair I'm enough. gonna be pissed, okay. Okay, when the game starts and you enter the first level, I will ask you the first question. So, go ahead and pick your level. Left or right? Which one would it be? I will go left. Okay. Yoshi's Island Good 1. Choice. Alright, so let's start with these questions since I've got a lot of questions to ask you. Okay, the first one's from Ashbear and she's... <clears throat> We've been through a lot now, getting to know each other and all that jazz. I was just wondering if uh, you'll like marry me or something. It'll be a full-time job and whatnot, but I think he'll be good at it. Also, bear my children. That wasn't the question, it was a demand. Congrats on almost 3,000 love, which now is 4,000. Um, I will definitely marry you. Um, sorry, sorry here, or mm. Silver Seat, um, to say that. And um, thanks for your demand, I will definitely be bearing your children tonight. Just hit me up as soon as you um, watch this video. Okay, later on she asks, can I marry that fine piece of Chris and ass? Which is kind of similar. Yes. And the answer to that is yes. Easily. Oh, okay. Also, favorite food? Chicken. Chicken. Oh my god. That's amazing. I love chicken too. Okay, next one. The really new mop 12,100. What are your 10 favorite YouTube fads? Um, honestly, I really don't understand that question. Maybe I suck because I'm a noob. But. Oh, I almost died. Oh my gosh. Um, whenever they started that together to the top movement that Athene started, I really thought that was neat, to tell you the truth. Fuck this mm -hmm. block. <laughs> Screw that block. But as far as like other fads, if you want to consider that a fad, you don't have to. I honestly, I, I don't really know how to answer that question, so feel free to be like, why you suck. I can't believe you didn't answer my question correctly. Just um, tell me what the hell. Tell me um, what you meant if you're still hanging around. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's the best awesome dream you've had? Oh god. I don't know how to answer that question because I don't really know what kind of dream you mean. Because it could be like a... It could be like, um... Maybe a zombie apocalypse type dream because I dream about zombies like all the time. and. Like, I'll have some sort of weapon. Usually it's um, a gun and stuff. You know, it's not very original or anything, but it's always really fun to have those kind of dreams. Or you could mean, like, are you ask are you trying to ask me if I've had, like, a wet dream or something? Because I don't really understand, but I'm just going to answer you with, I have a lot of zombie dreams. Honestly, I dream a lot, and most of them are zombie dreams, and I'm always kicking their asses. Or some, some way, something or another like that. But the funny thing is, like, whenever I get bit in my dreams, um... I usually wake up and I just feel kind of sick, so it's really interesting. Interesting stuff. That is really interesting stuff. He also asks, do you play PlayStation Home? Um, I have a PlayStation 3 and I've been on the PlayStation Home, but honestly I don't play it actively. Okay. To tell you the truth, it's just... PlayStation 3 is actually the console that I play the least, because I have a um, PlayStation 3, 360, and a Wii. Nice. Okay, on to the next question from DCW King. Later asked by Greenfire Dragon, why the name Cattle of Death? That's. Ooh, holy shit! <laughs> Whole. Oh shit, give me that. Okay. Oh wait, I actually didn't need that. But um, the name Cuddle of Death, it doesn't really have any significance. I've been asked that before, like, why is your name Cuddle of Death? And we just got Yoshi. Um. 
but here's a here's a story. Don't get offended by it, anyone. Oh crap! I just jumped off my Yoshi. Okay, whatever. Eat him. Okay, good. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Um, whenever I was younger, and I, I'm still like this. I love animals, but I was really stupid, and um, I caught this little baby rabbit. Well. <laughs> And by little baby rabbit, I mean like he could fit in the palm of your hand and holy shit, fuck off. Okay, um, whatever, I'm not gonna get those coins. Anyways, he could fit in the palm of your hand. Well, I hugged him really hard and, well, I thought he fell asleep. But what it actually happened is like, <laughs> I killed him. <laughs> and it's, keep pressing the wrong button. And it's like... It's just like a hug, it's not a cuddle of death, but it was more like a huggle of death, and to this day I still feel really bad about it, because I obviously didn't mean to kill him, but I was just a little little kid and didn't know any better, and you need to get out of my way. But seriously, it makes me so sad. Whatever though, I mean, just the name really doesn't have any significance, but if you want to have a little interesting story, there you go. Sorry, that took forever. <laughs> Okay. We have so many questions to answer. Yeah, we got a lot of questions to answer, so on with the next one. The Fox with a Blue Tail asks, What was the first video game console you owned? That would be a Nintendo Entertainment System. An NES, nice. Yeah, NES for short, if you want to get all technical and stuff. <laughs> yep. He later on asks, What are your favorite non Nintendo game series? Um, that would be. Oh my god. Oh shit. And <laughs> those aren't video game series. <laughs> that would honestly be, um, that, that's really difficult because I love the Final Fantasy series. Um, not the ones that came out for the Nintendo, obviously, but I've always loved the Final Fantasy games. Mm -hmm. Um, I, they always usually have interesting story, and I'm saying always a fucking lot. <laughs> but there's not gonna be a ground there. Yeah, you're okay. lucky you took the yellow, uh, yellow switch. Yeah. Else you would have fallen to your death, right? But okay. The next question is hi with a question mark. Hi. That is my answer. <laughs> okay. Does that count as a question? Yes. Okay. On to the next one. Dude says, what's 1011? What was your first game? Actual game. First game would be. Oh, that's really hard to remember. It's either Duck Hunt or Super Mario Bros. 3. Duck Hunt. Oh my god, that's nostalgia. Yes, Duck. I still have that game. <laughs> that counts is amazing. It is. It, it honestly is. Okay, you later on asked, do you have a de deviant art page? If so, what's the username? Um, I honestly do, but <laughs> I have. Oh my god! Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. So okay, <laughs> I have a deviant art page, but I honestly don't remember the name because I don't use it. I made it whenever I was like fifth. Yoshi can jump by. I made it whenever I was like 15 or 16 or something like that. And I honestly don't remember the name of it. Just to tell you the whole honest truth. Okay. But I might make one in the future. If I do, I'll, I'll link it on my YouTube. Okay, interesting. Next one from Ganon Slayer225. What is your favorite part of Let's Play? It would definitely be the people that I've met because honestly, um, I wouldn't be as happy as I am doing what I do and just playing games without all the people that I've met and I suck, but who cares, right? Um, because I'm always about friends and just having a good time and honestly, I never imagined myself talking to so many people and I've met so many people, different sub counts, different views, different videos, different types of of uh, gaming styles and different uh, all people across the world and that to me it means a lot and that's really fun that's my favorite part of let's play okay really nice i certainly agree it's just to add that helping is never done alone in my eyes it's let's let us play for a reason yep okay next one from d maractus and later on asked by rodney fire one what's your favorite video game franchise like any definitely pokemon pokemon, pokemon. Yeah, figures. easily easily figures Considering the content on your channel and stuff. Okay, um, from Performance V2, what makes you what you are as a person? Um, definitely my kindness for sure, because I am an extremely kind and outgoing person. I am not a judgmental person. I will always treat others how they treat me. So if you're going to be a jerk to me, obviously I'm just probably gonna ignore you or be a jerk back which I don't 
like to stoop to people's levels. So it's just mainly my kindness. And also, I'm really open. Um, I like talking about political issues, any type of issues, and your phone went off. Yep, it did. Thanks. Let me silence that. Okay, apologies for the interruption. <laughs> Let's go on. Anyways, it, it's just that, and I'm usually really positive, just outgoing. And oh my god, I made it to the castle. Nice. That's really nice. It, honestly, I, I'm doing better than what I thought. <laughs> oh boy, you jinxed it. Don't say that. If you do that, you're usually gonna die like really quickly. But okay. Same, same sort of question, but a little bit different. What one factor would you say develops what you are? It's kind of, kind of relating to this, but a little bit different. Um, it's, I think it's probably gonna have to be, trying not to die here. It, it's probably gonna be without me, I just ran right into that like an idiot. <gasps> okay, it's, okay, it's probably honestly gonna be just how open that I am, like I was saying, because if I wasn't as open as I am right now, I, I think I've actually inspired a bunch of people to do certain things with their lives. I'm always here for like advice on anything, even if it's just like random. And I'm always like one of the really cool people to talk to out there. Because you'd be surprised with some of the subjects that you can bring up with me. If that yep. makes any sense. I know exactly what you mean. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Next question is asked a lot and actually was to be expected. 89 rated RKO. Was it a chat? VVJ12357, Strive99, and Rfan5890 all ask the same thing. What is your favorite Pokemon? That would easily be... F I got it. <laughs> that would easily be Houndoom. That is by far my favorite Pokemon. Yep. Love Houndoom. It's, it's so gorgeous. Yep. <clears throat> Next question of Lil24 Marino. What's your favorite gaming system? Oh my god. Lots of Honestly, that, yeah, that is a lot of choices. A lot of people said GameCube on this one, but actually, um, because of the growing up factor. Ooh, wow. Um, are you st <laughs> stupidity? Stupidity at its finest. Um, that would. I, I have my best childhood memories on Nintendo 64. I totally agree. And 64 one. Okay. I Tubsy asked what? Um, he's not known as the skinny Snorlax, I believe. But I would say who, what, when, where, and why in response to that. Okay. He later on asked, have you ever had to park but wasn't sure if you would do it because you had company with you? Um, I think everyone's had that. Yep, I had that. It's... I had that too. It's like, oh, there are people around me. Should I do it or should I not? But I really have to. Usually I don't. But... Yeah. Oh shit! No, okay, I need this. I need to knock him off, I think. Yep. Okay. Okay, let's see. Next question from Sherwind99. What is your favorite hobby? Um, playing games. <laughs> dying, dying in, um, on this game, because I haven't have ever killed this boss. This is my first time with this guy. Okay. I don't know how I'm gonna knock him off, but I'll, I'll figure it out. No, it's actually, um,. There's a bunch of different things that I really like. Uh, I take a lot of pictures. I've been interested in photography for a while. I've done a lot of professional photography growing up. Mm -hmm. Journalism is one of my favorite hobbies too. Oh my god! Okay. You were lucky there. Okay, next one from Shemashima. You are stuck in an island. Yes, I say in an island. That's also written in the question. What four things would you bring with you in this set island? Me being one of them, of course, so in other words, three things only. Um, since we're bringing tree things only, I would definitely bring Silver Seat. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I would bring Lube. And I would, um,. God, what else would I bring? Oh my gosh. I would bring you, I'd bring lube, and... <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh god. I'm really- this, this is how 
swear, this might take a- <gasps> This might take a bit. You... Lube. And... And, um... Fuck. Fuck me! <laughs> Not in that. I need to get him one way. And... Chicken. Cause you like chicken, so do I. Okay, so me, Loop, and chicken. Me and Loop. Giggity. <laughs> <laughs>